Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Spiral the Dragon. In the previous episode we made it to Nasty Nork's uh, world. Nork world? Nasty world? Is that what they call it? I don't know. Anyway, uh, we're off to Twilight Harbor. We did the uh, Nark Cove in the last one. So yeah, who knows what's, uh, what, what lies ahead here. Except everyone knows except for me because I'm just so far behind in the times. Ooh, okay you got a machine gun. Please don't, please don't get me. Nope. Is it a bubble gun machine gun? That's pretty cool. Anyway, uh, so same as the last episode. Might have some weird cuts at some weird points here. I don't know what's gonna happen. I know all the episodes have really been kind of weird cuts, but like today specifically, I might be like in the middle of running through like a hallway and end up just cutting it. Uh, even like in the middle of saying something and just cut it. So just just be warned about it uh, prior and uh, then everything's good. Everyone won't really worry too much about what's happening. We have two different ways to go here, so I'm gonna go this way first. Uh, I'm so glad we're building up lives again. That was very scary in the previous episode when I had zero lives. I did not like that. Uh, so it's good that we're building them up again because we're definitely gonna need them for the final boss. I mean, all of the bosses so far have been fairly easy. <laughs> If I uh, do say so myself, I think they did that maybe on purpose, maybe not. I don't know. I'm glad we are not at Elden Ring levels of uh, bosses, though, because uh, that would not be good. I was expecting fully on dying there. Guess not. Guess we got luck on our side. Now, how do we get out of the situation, you may ask? Uh, you, you, you don't, I don't think. I think you just accept your fate and jump into the water. Okay, let's try this again. Please do not blast me off the edge this time. Thank you. We always get so lucky and unlucky at the same time. Like, I'll find a bug in the game and it will happen to, like, kill me for, like, the dumbest reason. But it will also be hilarious at the same time, so I'm okay with it. I don't know how I managed to break the games every single time, but, um... We just get very lucky with it, I guess. Oh, is it paint? I thought it was like bubble gum that he was trying to shoot at us. I was like, that's so nice. I walked right into it. I walked into it again. Because I like the color green, so that's why I thought Sparks would be better in this color. But let's make him blue because he's actually better in blue and that's definitely more so my favorite color. Oh wait, did we cure him? Oh no, he didn't get the butterfly. There we go. And then because I know Chelsea's gonna get so mad at this that he's blue and he's not fully yellow, he's, he's gonna be that. I'm sure that, I'm sure if Chelsea's saying it, then I'm sure other people are also getting annoyed by it. So I'm gonna try my best not to let that happen. Anyway, Cosmos. Thank you for rescuing me. I just don't really pay attention to Sparks that often. That's, that's all I have to say. I get hit. If I get knocked off the edge and die, then I'm like, whatever, I will respawn until like I run out of lives and then I'm like, ooh, maybe I should have not let that happen. Uh, how are we supposed to get that one over there? Did I miss something for getting this one? Hmm. Oh, well, we'll just leave it for now. Whoa, geez. We'll figure it out. I'm sure it will be important later on. Now that we've landed on one of these things, I feel like there's like a secret dealing with like parkouring across them all. It could be the case, but for now we're just gonna bypass it. Uh, we'll come back if we need to. Like that, for that chest that I so obviously missed. Boink, boink. The music's like all tropical and we're in like an industrial uh, uh, cove? I don't know. I like the lighting here too, it's very nice. This looks like something. Is this meant to be like this? Wait a minute, what's up there? Mm, oh, I see, we have a dash pad coming up here, okay. Cletus. These are all people we've seen before. Be on the lookout for Nork Commando, Spyro. They better be on the lookout for me. Why are they all ones that we've seen before? That's confusing. They're gonna explain that, right, in the story. Someone's gonna be like, yo, I've just been freezing them up after you saved them. Ha ha ha, joke's on you. You suck. 
Alright, let's go down here. Let's try this. Now we know how to get into that crate that I missed. Uh, for now, we're just going to land in here because we gotta get all of these gems and I do not feel like running up here again, but we're gonna have to do it anyway. There we go. And then I think we're gonna have to run straight through here, run down and around and smack our heads into that end. Oh, this is gonna take a few tries. What are the chances that I do this on my first try, though? What happens? What if I'm just so good at video games? Oh my goodness, I'm gonna actually do it on the first try! <laughs> okay, I was just gonna cut it to when I got to the top of that hill and ran down, but you know what? We're just gonna speed it up so everyone knows for, for sure that that was actually my first try doing that. Uh, not that it was really that tricky, but I definitely am way too proud of that moment to uh, not just skip it and just to speed it up instead. Anyway, <laughs> oh. and I know I could also definitely just like chop it in somehow perfectly, but uh, we're, we know we, we tell the truth here and nothing but the truth about um, these things. We don't lie about them because that would be rude and um, not at all fun. Plus, who cares? Oh, no. Sparks is blue. Oh, no. Now I'm never going to hear the end of it. Just is going to have a cow. Because there's no nothing here to light them up. <laughs> I'm just like trolling her as much as I can. She's going to hate me. She's going to see this episode and be like, what the heck are you on about? Or I'll cut all of this stuff out that I'm talking about. No, I'm not going to cut it out. I'm going to leave it in. We're going to leave it in just so she can be like, how dare you? And then she'll be extra salty. Oh, look. Sparks is now green. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, boy. I'm just like upsetting all of the um, the classic Spyro fans at once. That's what we do here, okay? Unless it's a game that I know how to play properly, I upset everyone else. Otherwise, I just upset myself while I'm like editing, or I'm killing myself laughing right now while editing, and I'll be like, "Ha ha, that was so good. I'm so smart. I'm so witty." Uh, how am I gonna do this? We're gonna die here. It's okay. We got green sparks to get us through. Yeah, we wouldn't have been able to do that if we had any other color sparks. I'm telling you right now. <laughs> okay, now I have to pick up the gems manually, though, so I am not happy with this. Is this my form of karma for letting him get that low? Mm, possibly. Oh, we missed some things. Oh, oh. Oh, wait, I see sparkles over there. I'm so glad they sparkle from far away. Wait, let me just press L3 to get sparks to, to point in the right direction. <laughs> oh, the, the karma's all coming back around. It's all hit, kicking me in the butt now. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to say anything bad. I shouldn't have done it. I made the jokes, and now, now I can't take them back. There we go. Green sparks is back. Uh, so whereabouts are these things? Are they up there? Oh, oh, it's right there. There's a, well, that's a extra life thingy. Shell? I know the proper names of these things, sure. Uh, clam. The clam life is up there. I don't know if that's actually important for anything. Ooh, maybe we have to be up there and we can jump out the window and go that way around? That seems about right. Yeah, and then we can probably glide to the top of this thing or something. Oh, look at that. They're all just like floating up there. So if I go out on the ledge here, though, I can get this. One extra life, always good because we know I'm going to need it. Uh, can I make this glide? I can. Okay, that was a lot easier to get all of them than I thought it would be. Nice. Woo, the Twilight Harbor is completed. Okay, next we're on to Nasty Nork already? Wait, I thought we had to beat all of his worlds? What about the one that there's not a world in there? What? Um, okay. Sure. Let's go. Ooh, thank you for the, uh, the gems. Oh, yeah, wait. Sparks is, uh, green. Let's get him back to full HP. Okay, Nasty Nork, I guess, already. Uh, early? One level early? What's the last level? <gasps> oh, wait, is the last level 100% level? Like the super duper crazy insane level? Oh, that's what that is. That's the 200% level. <gasps> so we are going to take on the final boss already. Hello. Oh, you're such a sick looking boss too. I mean, we've seen you already in the first cutscene ever of the game, but like the fact that we get to challenge you now. 
give me just like half a second to break all these chests and get all the gems. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, an egg, dude! We haven't seen one of you for like 500 years! You have a key! I was wondering about that. I'm like, I haven't had to chase down any eggs lately. Maybe, did I get all the eggs then, does that mean? That's a pretty sane thing to think about. I didn't think I got them all, but I'm glad I did. Yeah, I've learned all the secrets from getting all the other egg boys how to get the key now. Ha 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 ha. Oh, we're so good. Okay, I guess that's gonna unlock this and allow us to go and take him down, maybe? No? Oh, is this actually for a chest? Okay, do not get blasted by Nasty Nork. That would not be good. Does it open up this door? Oh, it does. Oh my goodness. Why is this the final battle kind of thing? I have to chase down all these guys with the keys? Wait a minute, give me a second here, bud. I need to get all of these jewels. They are all mine. Ooh, it's purpley over here, Dark Eco. Make as many references to past games that we've already been to as possible. Uh, where did you go? Wait, he went back into the this one here, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, when did you jump down? I forgot to see where the aerial part was. Oh, ho, ho, we didn't even have to do it at the fancy point. I just got to do it whenever I felt like it. <laughs> Let's go. Okay, um, now do I take this key to you? Thank you. Look at how mad he is. Why so mad? <laughs> okay, so I was gonna make a joke and say that First of all, I was gonna be like, oh, look, it's Chelsea. But then the second the second joke on top of that was gonna be, oh, face only a mother could love. And then I realized both of those combined together uh, result in something terrible. And yeah, I, I know I just like straight up said it, but I'm prefixing it by saying I was going to say a joke. So um, that nulls the fact that it's actually a joke. But then again, it is a joke, but also it, it just completely nulls the fact that I, I was saying something completely hurtful and uh, mean. So, uh, yeah, that's that's how we're going with that. <laughs> oh, man, what am I saying? I'm losing it? Yeah, definitely losing it. Should we start the next game after I finish this one today? That's the next question. Do I play on and continue and um, start off with some insane episodes for whatever the next game is, Ripto's Rage? Or, hmm, definitely gonna have some insane moments. Hello? Do I just have to keep chasing you? Oh, you are your your own kind of, uh, what's it called? Egg boy. Okay. Okay, well, um... I don't know what we're supposed to do here because he's got armor, but I guess he doesn't have shiny armor. Oh, jeez, I almost fell off the edge. That was terrifying. And uh, I, I guess I'll try and blast him with the... Uh, I was going to say a heat blast. <laughs> what is happening? Brain, you're on some other level today. Let's go... Uh, let's tone it down a bit. The angst, yeah, a little bit. Hello, sir. So, uh, you going to tell me how to beat you or are we just going to keep running in circles? Huh? Huh? I guess we're gonna keep running in circles. <laughs> oh, I got him once! Okay. That that took way too long to get to that point. Uh, I also learned that if I die, I have to re-collect the keys and whatnot. So, um, yeah. Um, okay. I'm not panicking at all. It's fine. Uh... Oh, no. Was he really, like, that easy the entire time? I just had to, like, charge right into his chest, and then I could have easily just done the thing. Oh, these are all disappearing right underneath my legs. Okay, that's cool to know. You're toast, Nork! <laughs> So long. Almost forgot about you guys. What about Ganasty Ganork? Nasty Ganork.
Toasty Nork is toast. So now there's order again in the Dragon Kingdom? Uh, well, mostly. I've still got some treasure to find. What will you do next? I'd say the sky's the limit. Oh. Okay, so that... <laughs> Um, I was expecting a, a little bit more uh, of a crazier battle. I mean, I guess the last part, I ran around that area like 500 times, so I guess that's good. But um, I guess we beat him. We did it. Uh, it was the same as the other bosses. Okay, cool. I, um, yay, we did it. I beat the game. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, is there anything like after the credits? I love the art. I love the art, but like, is there anything after the credits? Let's see if we can skip ahead a little bit. Okay, okay, we're back here. Uh, do I have to get this dragon again and will he open up this one? Magnus! Nasty's ancient history now. So, what's in there? I believe this is Nasty's treasure hoard. But the gate will only open if you have found everything in the Dragon Kingdom. Come back when you have reached 100%. Oh, sick. I'm in the money! Oh, thank you everyone who left the comments and told me I should get everything beforehand. That was very nice of you, because otherwise I would've got to this point and been like, ah, now I gotta go back and get everything. But, um, let's go. Let's go see. Okay. Return home's up there. What am I gonna get from this place? Is it 2,000 gems? Okay. Okay. Okay, we can get 2,000 gems. Um... Question number one, how the heck do I get off of this platform? Sorry, two, 2,000 is a very overwhelming number. Um, I'm not even at that many subscribers yet, so I don't have to worry about that many people seeing this video, but like, uh, ooh. Let's, let's try this way. That's, no, don't do that. Oh, you can fly. I thought you could do something different there compared to like what was happening. I'm like, that's a little weird of a flying mechanic or uh, like how we jumped down into the, the water there was a little funky, but hey, cool. Uh, it's like a mixture level then where we can do flying and uh, run around and collect the gems and whatnot. Sure, sure. Sounds good to me. So I got really lucky with the, the awkward timing of the cut. Um, I had to basically cut the episode short, uh, like just as we started to fight Nasty Nork before. So uh, it was very it was very good for um, the episode. It was probably very flawless, other than like the fact that I feel like my nose, nose my voice sounds a little, um, I don't know, a little nas nasalier than usual. I think that's the only thing that I have to say. But other than that, like, it's probably, like, a flawless cut. Uh, come here, you. Also, we're doing this all in the one episode because I was going to put this into its own episode, but, like, why would I do that when I've had so many short episodes? So now we're going to have one, like, longer episode as a result. If I can actually get this guy. Ha 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 ha. Ha ha ha. I'm so good at getting them now. Oh, uh, I'm loving the uh, the 25 gems and the and such 25 and um, 10. It's very nice. Now, what am I supposed to do with this? Can I go over into this place here? Ah. And then now we're higher up. So does that mean I can like fly to other places because I'm higher up here? Maybe. Oh, we probably have to fly through this uh, this little lava section right under um, over here. That's probably has some secrets in there too, right? Oh, sweet. Now, if only I could control Spyro uh, properly today, it would probably be great. Life would be really good for everyone. But since I uh, I still suck at the game, even after. What, how many episodes has it been? 14 or so? No, more than that. Eh, less than that? 13. 14. 
I don't know how many episodes we're at. Oh no, not one of these guys that goes in a circle. Last time this guy caused me so many, so much trouble. I had to tell a story to like, in order to get him. Okay, there we go. That wasn't too bad. Just a little focus required, but then life was good. Oh, there's a firework up there. I see it. Hmm. Oh, that's gonna get that little chest up there. Okay, let's go through here. I don't know where this key's going yet. Um, possibly I do. I probably have seen it already. I think actually I do know where it goes thinking about it for more than two seconds. But I thought I should fly in here and see what's in here. I love the look of the lava in here. It looks so good. <laughs> the lava mixed with like these lights up top. Oh, amazing. So cool. Uh, I don't know what that sound was in there, but uh, sure. Yeah, this is the spot, right? Oh, okay. A guy with a plane. Are we gonna take him out? Possibly? Oh, yeah. We're definitely gonna have to take him out. I didn't realize it was one of the fancy egg stealer snatcher boys. Okay, let's light you up. Nice. Oh, here's where the next key goes, which is probably from taking out that guy from the plane right there, this guy. Oh, he can fly faster. What happens if I go the opposite way? Are you smart enough to know that? Hmm, 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 hmm. Okay, okay, so he's smart enough to know it, but that's also how you do it, right? <laughs> I got him. Oh, man. It took that a little bit longer once again, but like, once you get it, oh, it's so satisfying. Okay, let's go over here and get this uh, firework because I feel like I'm going to forget about it. Whee! So, um, yeah, 2,000 gems. Not as intense as it seems with uh, just the big values, the yellow and the purple all the time. Still scary. We're not even halfway yet, but, like, less scary than I, I was originally thinking. Can I get this guy easily? <laughs> oh, why did I even say it? Why? Well, that wasn't actually too bad. I didn't even have to go around here, like, one full time. Look at that. It parked us perfectly at this point. Okay, okay. One more gem. What else you got for me in here? Anything? Nothing? Am I, I, I'm definitely missing something in there, right? Or is that just to say, like, yo, you can now fly higher? That could be it, too. Whee! So is this only going to give us like half of the amount of gems? Where are we going to get the other thousand from? Um. Oh wait, I see the other firework. Because we're still like a thousand short. Unless there's going to be like a proper flying level for the other half of this level. Is that what's going to happen? Oh no. No, 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 game. You can't do that to me. It's gonna stop on a weird number. 950? Okay. So we can return home. That's okay. We're not going home yet. Let's go in here. There's a lot of purple gems in here. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Ooh. Oh my goodness, look at the vault. Okay, okay. Is this gonna, oh, <laughs> that's so satisfying. Oh my goodness, look at all the purple. Oh, this would be a beautiful screenshot if I could do it, but I don't think I can make this work. Let's just pick them all up. Oh, look at that. I was wondering where we were going to get the other amount of, like, thousands of gems. Oh, boy. Hoarder! Oh, yeah! Look at him. And he's got his little Christmas lights. We did it! 
Gnolage is the power to turn into dragon or dragons to crystals. Oh, this is oh, this is from the first cutscene. Ah, uh, I see. I get it all. Wow, look at all these amazing inspirational quotes on the walls. Wow, 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 wow. Let's get all to, he gets all this love too. Anyway, um, is that it? Let's see if there's anything if we get, go back here or if that's if that's literally if that's it. Spyro the dragon, you've defeated Ganasty Ganor, collected the dragon eggs, saved all the dragons, and recovered every bit of treasure in the Dragon Kingdom. How do you feel? I feel fired up, Bob, and I'm happy for the dragon world, of course. I certainly wouldn't want to spend the rest of my dragon days butting heads with Nasty Nork and his weird minions. What's a minion? Uh, never mind. You know what they say, for every good battle, you need a good adversary. And I felt that Nasty, in spite of his misguided nature, was a worthy opponent. Uh-oh. Here we go again. Oh, that was so good. Uh, I had to put on his sunglasses just for this final bit because, like, I didn't know he had them in that little cutscene. That's so amazing. Anyway, that's going to do it for uh, Spiral Dragon, at least the first game. So I want to thank you all so much for watching this episode of Spiral Dragon and also all the other episodes if you watched all them as well. And uh, I hope you all have a great rest of your day. I'll see you tomorrow for some Ripto's Rage. Goodbye for now, my friends. <laughs>